in number theory here is the following setup for all x y as a natural number satisfy this following equation we have x cubed equals y to the 15 minus 20 21 okay so the question does this equation accept solution or no okay uh, i have brought you another crazy problem but it's not too crazy but you know just you need that trick okay we get these two different exponents cubed and 15 okay so how we gonna deal with this one so if I'm going to use the Fermi Clearly theorem on this one, it will be more easier to solve this one, okay? So, as you know, if we have P as a prime, not divides A as an integer by Fermi Clearly theorem, implies A to the P minus number one is a congruent to one mod P, okay? So I'm going to use this one here. So which one is going to be integer? Which one is going to be a prime here? So, if I'm going to set p equals 31 as a prime and y is a natural number, is an integer, okay? So we'll have here y to the th theory because p minus number one is a congruent to one mod 31, okay? So I'm going to work on this essential thing. This is very important. That's we take a look at this exponent 15 and 30. We have a kind of relationship between those numbers okay so how gonna make this one link to this one so before before reducing the equation to the math 31 notice here we get 2 20 21 equals 31 is multiplied by 65 plus number 6 okay if i'm going to reduce the equ this equation to the math 31 i get here 20 21 is a congruent to 6 math 31 so let's apply this one on this one here so I get the following. So I get y to the 15. I'm going to write this one in terms of y. y to the 15 equals x cubed plus 20, 21. Now we are, now we are worried to reduce the equation to, to, to mod 31. So I will have here plus number 6 mod 31. So we get the reminders x cubed plus number 6. But we don't know what's the possible reminders for x cubed when you reduce this one to the mod 31 okay so if i'm going through the charts you guys you can use a chart because the chart you will be a crazy numbers there i'm going to give you just a reminders what i have done before okay because i cannot go through the chart because it is going to be a lot of calculation there so you guys you can figure out so i get the following reminders x cubed from this set okay i get minus eight minus 4 and minus 2 minus 1 and 0 and 1 and 2 and 8 and 9 and 16 mod 31 when you reduce this one to mod 31 okay now we have another extra term which is 6 I'm going to add 6 on this possible values so you get x cubed plus number 6 belongs to this set just i'm simply i'm going to add number six on each term here so six minus eight is going to give us minus two this one minus four becomes number two this one becomes four this one becomes five zero becomes six one becomes seven two becomes eight eight becomes fourteen nine plus six fifteen sixteen 16 plus 6, 22. This is all the possible reminders we, which we can find, okay? If x cubed plus 6 belongs to this set, which means y to the 15 be belongs to this set because we have equality, okay? What does mean? We are not solving the equation yet. We are just proving 31 cannot divide y, y okay? Because in order to have 31 as a prime, divides y, which means the remainder must be 0. But we don't have no 0, absence of the 0 here in the remainder. Which means this one immediately, 31, not divides y. What does mean? That means it's verifying the Fermi Clearly theorem. It's verifying the Fermi Clearly theorem. Now we are allowed to apply the Fermi Clearly theorem. Okay? 
So since we get 31, not divide y, which means I'm going to apply this rule, fermi Lero theorem, okay? So using the fermi Lero theorem, just exactly on this one, I'm going to square both sides here by fermi Lero theorem, okay, this one. I'm going to square both sides, I get y to the 15, which is a congruent of plus or minus mod 31. It's more simple, okay? Now we are ready to make the comparison between this statement, which is statement number two, and this statement, which is statement number one, okay? So we have extracted two things from this set. We have proven two things. We have proven 31 not divides y, which is allows to apply the fermi theorem. Then after fermi theorem, we have extracted this equation, okay? We know y to the 15 is always congruent to plus one or minus one minus 31 by fermi theorem. But here we get y to the 15, which equals x cubed plus six. We get the reminders, this one. None of these values are available in this set which means we have no solutions. This one immediately tell us, let's put this equation as a, as a purple star. This equation as a purple star, no solution. Okay. So I have proven this one, by the way, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and support the channel. And thank you for watching, we'll see you next video. Bye.